Hey, 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 how's everybody doing today? This is your mindful message, and I'm so glad that you could be here. And so join me today for your spirit guides offering advice, along with my spirit guides and Angie's spirit guides, to give you the, the best advice for today, because it changes every single day. So what are the energies today trying to tell you? Stay tuned, and we will help you through all of this. So Angie's cards were Angels Among Us and The Fool. But since this is the shadow perspective, we're going to be giving the shadow, what's going on within the shadow, the darkness, that maybe you're not seeing, because that's all the shadow is. The shadow is just everything you hold down and the triggers and this anger. So the shadow wants to be addressed so that once you address the shadow, it can leave and no more shadow. And that's just fantastic. It is very fantastic. So I'm going to be bringing in a spirit. He's an ascended master of the light and I'm going to be bringing him in and he's going to be addressing what advice your spirit guides have for you today pertaining to the shadow of this reading and that because this is for all of you so this is going to hit everybody that's watching this and that so pay attention in here where are you you know which one is yours which one is yours and when it is and it has been addressed you know please like and comment and let us know because it's very beautiful when it can be validated by all of you because they will give you this information it's valuable and when it's yours write it down in that and maybe there's multiple that are yours. You don't have to stop at one. So, this is the Ascended Master of the Light. Immense greetings to everybody. So, all your spirit guides around talking about the shadow. I am picking up a lot of doubts. I am picking up a lot of energies of fear. A lot of anger. I, guess I see a lot of anger happening either to you or you are the one directing it outwards. And it's because you're frustrated with no direction. And that falls on you, my friend. That falls on you, not somebody else. So a lot of you are frustrated at the position you are in. And this is no other fault but yours. You know, if somebody's coming at you for some, or, you know, coming at you in any scenario and you react to it, well, that is your part. You are reacting to whatever this is. And know that you're responsible for all of your behavior and anything coming at you. You're, you're responsible for how you decide to react to this coming at you. So I'm getting a lot of that. I'm getting a lot of maybe some couples and then they're fighting in that. They're not feeling like angels. They're, they're, they're asking, they feel, they're praying and they're feeling they're not being heard, but you are being heard, my, my beautiful earth angels. You are being heard from your divine team. They are asking you to be patient. There's a lot of patience. There's like, I get a job coming forth and there's somebody very angst maybe a young girl that I am picking up. She's very wanting this job. And my advice is to step back and don't think about it so much. Just believe you already have this job that you are putting out and it will be yours in that. And I get a lot of others that are in the middle of spiritual awakening. And it's a beautiful thing. And reach out. Your guides have been trying to get your attention to reach out. I'm getting a lot of people seeing. I'm seeing a lot of people hearing. I get a lot of like ailments. Maybe your back, your stomach. It could mean your chakras are not aligned. Or maybe you've got some aura, some things stuck on your aura. I get a lot of people right now have some triggers that they need to address. So this is what I am seeing today. And if whatever is ailing you has not been addressed today, it means that it will be addressed tomorrow or the, whenever it is needed for you to hear whatever is meant for you, because that's how the divine works. So I'm going to send some love to all of those going through some struggles and fears and doubts. And this is going to help you align yourself to the great divine, to the love of your spirit guides, and simply asking your spirit guides that they, you need their help, that you really, really would love a name if you don't know the name, and a direction to go, because the full reverse is saying that there is no direction. 
right now. And I also feel some people need to set an attention. Maybe need some need a journal and that. So, and I'm getting some insomnia and they're saying you need to rest or some that I, I'm picking up, need to go to the doctor, but don't be scared. The outcome isn't going to be what you are thinking and don't self diagnose that you should go somewhere else like to a doctor and get this diagnosed. Facebook is not the cure for this. And I hope this energy is helping you. It's going to help clear your energies, your aura. And let's have Archangel Michael cut the cords of all joining me. And, and with that, I can't wait to join you tomorrow. And I cannot wait to maybe read you know, all of these comments and things like that, because your guides have, are bringing all of this beautiful knowledge and, and praying. I know a lot of people are praying or you're asking for assistance and help. And I am here to tell you that your, your prayers are being heard. So don't ever think that if it's not being heard, no, whatever is to come is for your highest good and in divine timing they don't ever the universe doesn't want to give you something you're not prepared for they want you to be understand the vibration and when this hits the and the prayer is also going to be so much better than you could ever imagine and he is hearing at a, a, a there's some sick people and he is saying to all of you with this that is going to be okay not and if any bad news is coming to some other people he is the, the divine is saying don't fret this and don't think that he does not exist and don't think you did anything wrong because you didn't gotta remember everybody's on their own journey and that includes others that are maybe coming to the end of their journey they have fulfilled their part and when it's time for them to go home they will go home and that and they're always with you always with you just because it's not in the physical body don't mean that they're not so I'm going to bring Michelle back and I hope these messages come forth and you feel that the love that is coming behind all of this, because it's very important to know your spirit guides are here. They are listening to you and they want you to know they love you. And it's no coincidence that you hit this TikTok video because there's something they want you to know. And the beautiful thing is you can do this as well. Just by asking, can I talk to my spirit guides for the highest good? And the knowledge that you will get will be perfect for you. So I'm going to bring Michelle back. Thank you very much and much love. Thank you. So I hope that everybody out there that's watching got your message. And if you did not receive a message, then stay tuned tomorrow and the next day because maybe today just wasn't the day your spirit guide felt like handing this to this information to you. And if, if you did not get this message or you think it might pertain to you, it probably is pertaining to you. So if you're asking and you should feel a gut, you would just feel like a gut reaction to this. And that is how your guides are telling you, yes, that is for you. And again, there might be multiple for you and it pertains to you. So we do this for love and we want you to know that your spirit guides do hear you. They love you and they just want the best for you until you come home and that in fulfilling your journey and going to love and out of your cave. So I am Michelle. I'm a special kind of special. What is your special kind of special? Share below what your special kind of special is because your special kind of special, whatever it is, is perfect. It is beautiful because the divine gave this to you. It gave that to you. And it's like, yeah, yes. So much love from all of us from Blue Heavens to all of you. And we will see you tomorrow for another Oracle read and a mindful message from Blue Heavens and your spirit guides. And much love. Adios.